What's up, world? Welcome home. We are here in beautiful, sunny Poway, a fantastic community, a community with one of the highest rated school districts in all of the country, a community that is beautiful and sunny, a community that has everything you need and then some, especially if you like golfing. Now this property that we're gonna be touring in just a moment is unbelievable. The agent you will recognize from the show and when we get to the backyard, wait until you see this. This is more than a resort-like backyard, it is paradise. So without further ado, let's go take a look inside and make sure you stay tuned till the end because we have something very special that we're gonna be surprising the agent with. So follow me. Brent Humphreys. Welcome to Lakeview Road. How are we? Great, how are you? I am good. Actually, I'm great. I'm excited to be here you at this be. unbelievable property. Yeah. Uh, give us the overview. Here we are in the entry rotunda, 16110 Lakeview Road in Poway. Custom built home, architecturally a masterpiece. You hear that a lot in real estate shows. This is truth in advertising. This property has 5,062 square feet, dual levels with two different family rooms, a gorgeous office, nearly a thousand square feet of exterior deck, 270 degree panoramic views of all of North County. And it sits on 1.3 acres with an absolute paradise of a resort down, down below, an oasis really with a huge pool, a spa, a waterfall, a wrought iron gated water slide, three entertaining palapas, a private beach area with sand and Adirondack chairs, fireplaces, fire pits. Some of the features that really impressed me, and there are many, are that you have high ceilings everywhere, as high as 14 feet. Wow. Just in this formal sitting room, you have three sets of dual French doors, so you can get out on the deck at different times and have your morning coffee. Mr. Nakamura, the architect, did a wonderful job integrating straight lines and curved arches. Every room in this house, has a curved or a straight feature that blend. It's just, it's perfect. So as we walk over here, first of all, just notice how much light there is. There are windows everywhere in this property and a very special feature that I'm gonna show you in a minute in the next room. Unobstructed views wow. throughout the property. It's been reported that there's been $1 million spent just on the exterior of the home. As we walk down the hall here, this is family room number one of two. What I love about this room is that it is drenched in natural light, but what you may not notice is that the builder put wow. in a beautiful light channel or light pipe. I've, I've heard it alternated. Eight different windows. Wow. Four facing east, four facing west. So regardless of where the sun might be, as long as it's up, you're gonna get drenched in light. Very subtle, but it's very beautiful. You have yet another door to the uh, nearly thousand square foot balcony. Integrated surround sound. Even in the kitchen, you've got the straight lines of granite and you've got the curved counters. I love this kitchen because you can entertain a lot of people here. It's been reported that they've had parties with hundreds of people in this home where they've shuttled them in from Poway High School. I think they need a permit for that and I know they got one. <laughs> but you've got high-end appliances, Viking Professional stainless steel fridge, dual oven, beautiful microwave, the incredible cooktop, and a bread warming drawer. So you will never have cold bread in this property. And everywhere you're standing, the architect did such a great job because there are windows that showcase the views. As we continue down the hallway here, a beautiful room, the master retreat. Wow, that's what you, that's the first word that comes to mind when you enter. This is, this is a master retreat. I mean, you look at how big it is. Another d double door entry, another balcony calling your name for your morning coffee or taking in the sunsets. Again, one of the four fireplaces, truly high ceilings. Who has a chandelier in their master? I don't know. Incredible. You do here, right? I know that I'm a little bit vertically challenged. <laughs> this, this home brings out that awareness even more. It really accentuates it. 
But look at this master bath with the dual vanity, which you'd expect, and the jetted tub, the Royal Craft Wood. This is fit for royalty. to the lower level of the property. This is family room wow. number two. This is amazing. In a moment, I'm gonna lower the 150 inch screen. For wow. You. We've got the Hunter Douglas shades. We can black out the room. We've got integrated media in the wall and no the ceiling. No way. 4K projector. If you really are enjoying a movie and you need to use the restroom, you have your own restroom and shower right off the theater. Wow, and had we not seen the master retreat, I thought this well, could have this, been that. This could very well be a, a secondary master suite because it's got its full interior bath, dual vanity, separate entrance. It's extremely spacious. Again, recessed ceiling. I, I love just the smooth texture drywall as well. And multiple windows. Very nice, a home with everything and then some. And then of course oh. you have the access back out onto the back patio. Wow. Look at this patio and a fountain and a wrought iron gate and the arches and the integration with the stone. So let's, let's continue on inside. Oh wow, and look at this, this is beautiful. This is one of the spaces you're never gonna wanna leave. And I don't know that you would ever need to. No, you wouldn't. I mean, you could have the kids up here, the grown-ups down there, the friends over there, the back, the 30-foot waterfall that you haven't even seen yet. It has a perfect entertaining area with unobstructed views. It's even elevated, it's higher than we are now. Thank you, Brent. Wow, this is what I've been waiting for, Brent. The backyard. Comes with the home, too. <laughs> there we go. Two-part deal. This is not a timeshare. <laughs> this is not frack ownership. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Wow, this is unbelievable. You truly get the sense of grandeur. And when you look back at a property like this, you know you've made it in life, right, Brent? <laughs> you truly have. So first of all, just notice how large this patio is and the canary palms that tower over you. Multiple exits, multiple walking trails around the property, wrought iron gates at various places, railings, the palapas. We've just got to get down there. And Let's go. It. You know, I'm hearing the water and whenever I hear water, it kind of just pulls me towards it. Yeah. So Ty, there are many features out here I'm excited to share with you, but let's start with the spa. Comfortably seats 10 people. My client believes it's approximately 7,000 gallons. I don't want to say exactly 7,000 because if I'm wrong, that'd get me in hot water. <laughs> there we go. But everything too here is controllable by a remote. So you can press a button, you can turn on the lights. It's got all kinds of different mood settings, different lights, colors, beautiful integration with the, one of the many waterfalls in the property overflowing into the pool. everywhere you know you can't say oh I'm sorry I didn't send you the invitation to the party I didn't have the room no you have the room you know I didn't want to leave the jacuzzi area but I mean being down here is just as amazing yeah. and might even be just as relaxing you know jacuzzi's relaxing yeah. but as you mentioned look at all these chairs the palapas the waterfalls the beach wow the beach the beach sand there we go beautiful San Diego Oh my gosh. Ty is one of 
three different palapas with the lighting. And at night, this is absolutely stunning. Oh my gosh. As with the fire fire pits and fireplaces and entertaining patios where, and French door where you could just choose a different one each night of the week. Oh, it's Wednesday. I'll go to palapa number one. I'll just sit here in this chair and just relax with the water features. And say, I've made it. Again, $40,000 invested just in exterior lighting. A lot of it is down here. If you think this looks wonderful right now, you really need to come back. In fact, you're invited. There we go. We need to sit here, flip on all the lights, change the color, change the mood, change the ambiance, and just unwind at Lakeview Road. Another table, six more chairs, Palapa number two. Just remarkable. You could sit here. I mean, you could have corporate parties here. I feel like I'm at like a theme park or something. This home has everything. It truly does. And the nice thing about it too is it feels, you know, even though there is the lush landscaping, you're gonna do a lot of living here and not a whole lot of maintaining. Everything is perfect. There's a ton of hardscape, but there's still a ton of greenery and the pebble rock and the pebble wall rock and, and detail. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's incredible. So I think it's time to look at some additional grounds because we haven't even scratched the surface. There's more to come. Another seating area, Palapa number three with another entertaining area. This is where I can picture the taco bar. You may not notice it, granite countertops, oh, wow. just Very like nice. inside, 12 foot fireplace. I sat at this fireplace a couple nights ago. The stars, it was a really clear night and you had the crackling fire and that, that scent of, of burning wood. It was just fabulous. And then an area that I don't spend a whole lot of time because I'm five foot three, <laughs> but a professional grade basketball court. Wow. Or badminton. Entrances on both sides, beautiful sport court. Thank you for not asking me to throw a ball. I, I mean, was gonna bring one. I was gonna, oh, well, hey. Oh, shoot. Brent? There is. I don't okay. know. This Let's do it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> there we go, Brett. All right, if I didn't make it, I'd be a basket case. Oh, I don't know. Did that go in? Leave a comment below. Probably the most private spot. In yes, the whole I had no idea this was here. Yeah, another gate up there. This is just down off the upper driveway to the other two car garage. And you have just all of the pebble rock and all, and this is all lit up at night. But take a look at this view. Oh my gosh. Wow, I loved the pool area, but, and I never thought I would say that. I could love anything more than the pool, yeah. but there's this, a there's a lot to love in there's this area. There's a lot to love. Yeah, wow. But and then for there. anyone with a green thumb, you also have the ability to have your own garden, wake up in the morning, pick your fresh fruits and vegetables, head back inside. Okay, 30 fruit trees at the property. Oh, wow. So yeah, you already have that going too. Okay, so here's your waterfall. This is where you throw the switch. Watch this, Ty. Can it get much better than this? No, I don't think that I can. don't think it can either. Look, look at the water on its way down. The mountains. Oh man. Wow, this is Here unbelievable. Goes. Don't miss it. We've done a lot of homes in the show and never has anybody flipped a switch and we've just watched the water roll down the hillside. What a great property. Well, Brent, 
thank you for having us out. Uh, but what do you love about the home? What are your top three things? You have five hours? <laughs> there we go. I would say that this is a property where you can absolutely have it all. And if you love the outdoors, you have everything you want, every possible patio to entertain. I think there's just something really soothing about the ambiance of nearly 70,000 gallons of water and views out of every single window. As uh, we kind of wrap up here at the home, the episode is not over. Uh, being that we had you back in the episode and in the show today, um, we wanted to say welcome back. And instead of having um, us head to the airport, we're bringing the airport to us. So if you can hear that in the background, the helicopter is just about here. So cheers again. Cheers. And uh, let's go take a community tour. Thank you. Sounds good. We'll see you in the air. And uh, surprise, we had to bring the helicopter to you. You've been in the show so much that uh, we had to do this today. And I'm overly excited for this aerial flight over Poway. Um, as we're taking off here, talk a little bit about this neighborhood and what a luxury it would be to live here. Certainly. Look at this. We're, we're flying over 1.3 acres wow. with a nearly 70,000 gallon pool, yeah. a beautiful uh, nearly 7,000 gallon spa, yeah. a waterfall, a complete oasis, a water slide. You know, as we fly over this estate, though, it's, it's truly remarkable. I mean, it's the architect, Mr. Nakamura, designed this very, very thoughtfully. And every single room of this property, you have gorgeous sunset views. I chatted with my client, the sunsets convey. They're going to wow. convey Oh, that there we go. Yeah, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Lake Poway, just 1.2 miles away, is a fabulous place. If you enjoy fishing, it's trout season right now. And look at that. We're right over Lake yeah, Poway. It's, it's <laughs> unbelievable. They keep dropping you know, 1,500 pounds of trout into the uh, wow. into the lake. You can you can get catfish and uh, bluegill and sunfish, and it just it, it, it's incredible. The value here is incredible as well. Not just the home, but if you want to go spend the day on Lake Poway and rent a motorboat, it's thirty dollars for the entire day. Whereas Lake Hodges, which is also a wonderful lake, I grew up there fishing with my dad, but it's forty-five dollars for two hours and fifteen for each additional. So for $30 to spend a day on Lake Poway, you know, have a motorboat is incredible. And just like that, now we're over Lake Hodges, another yep. great amenity here yes. in Escondido, which borders, of course, Poway. Yep. Um, there's so much around here. It and we'll talk is. about, we got to go back to, to Madera's after this. But what do you oh. love about Lake Hodges? It's a, it's a beautiful place. I grew up there as a, as a young child trying oh, wow. to get fish. The problem is I was a little bit too talkative. I scared the fish away. <laughs> I think my dad finally gave up on me. Yeah. But Madeiras Golf Club, I mean, we ought to we ought to definitely go get the Cobb salad there at the grill. Oh wow. Madeiras is fantastic, but beautiful 18-hole course, wonderful, wonderful place, just two miles northeast of us. Wow. If you want a home that has all of this grandeur and no Melarus and no HOA, this is the place to be. Yeah, absolutely. And you never need to leave. There have been parties here reportedly with 1,000 people. The, the, the property's been featured on MTV Cribs. Okay. And it's definitely, I mean, you can understand yeah, why. Yeah, absolutely. And I have heard on good, in, good, good information that Maroon 5 has played at this property. Very nice. That's why I wanted to dance when I was at the yeah, home. There you go. Exactly. <laughs> well, the home shines a huge shout out to the homeowners a huge shout out to you thank, thank you, you so much for having us yeah. out uh, but what do you say we go back to the home we land and we go hang out at the pool i think that sounds great incredible yeah they were they were excited about it. Hey, her. they were. Yeah. yeah. We could go round and round about helicopters. I know. Oh, they're back. What's up, guys? You're hey. back. Uh, we had to come back to the home because it's that amazing. But overall, I just wanted to say thank you for getting to this point in the video. Huge thank you to you, Brent. Welcome back to the show. 
a huge thank you to the homeowners and everybody like and subscribe like and subscribe. there we go like and subscribe and as always <laughs> oh as, as always we will see you at the next so cheers brett cheers Woo!